Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if Wake on LAN is not working properly on your Windows computer. So we're going to go about doing this by opening up the Start menu. Type in Device Manager. Best result should say Device Manager. So go ahead and left click on that to open it up. Select the Network Adapter section, so double click on it. And then whatever your network adapter is listed under here, so probably the first one in most cases, you want to right click on it and select properties. Select power management. And you want to make sure these items are checkmarked in here. Let's say allow this computer to turn off this device to save power. Allow this device to wake the computer and then only allow a magic packet to wake the computer. And additionally, if you're using an Intel network connection, you might also have additional options here where it's say wake on LAN when you are underneath the power management tab that will say wake on magic packet as well as wake on pattern match so you want to have wake on magic packet enabled as you see here um, but you might also have an option that says wake on pattern match you want to turn that off so uncheck that option and then once you're done with that you just will go ahead and select OK save any changes you made to close out of here restart your computer see if that resolves the problem Another thing we can go ahead and try here as well would be to open up the start menu, type in power options. As a result, should go back to power and sleep settings. Go ahead and lock click on that. On the right side, underneath related settings, select additional power settings. Across from wherever your preferred plan is, you want to select change plan settings. And then change advanced power settings. Now you want to expand the PCI Express section, so just click a little plus under it. And then if there's a link, state power management, do the same thing. And then whatever option, so for both on battery, you want to turn that off. So if there is a setting to turn it off, you want to go ahead and just change it to the off position. However, if you have a laptop and there is a plugged in option, you want to also turn that off. So make sure both, if there are more than one, that they are all turned off. Again, underneath the link, state power management. And then once you're done with that, you would close out of here after selecting apply and OK. Restart your computer, and then hopefully the issue should have been resolved. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.